Opa, and welcome to another episode of Jack the Greek. Today's a special episode because it's Father's Day. And today it's dedicated to the fathers out there. As you might see, I have a beautiful apron on today. Opa, purchased by my kids and it's given it to me this morning in bed with my morning breakfast. So thank you very much kids for the beautiful Father's Day. Now it's my turn to share this beautiful meal with you guys straight after this, uh, this taking. So what we got on today, we're very special, some beautiful calamari. We have some seafood mix and we have some be beautiful crabs as well. So we're gonna make a stuffed calamari with some crabs on the side with some garlic butter. So here we go. So while we're preparing our food, we've just turned on the Crossroad barbecue by heat strip. We're gonna let that get nice and warm and it shouldn't take more than about five minutes now. So we'll grab our beautiful calamari. There we go there. We'll just leave it here so we know exactly what we need. We grab a bowl, grab our prawns just over here and we'll cut them up into little bit, bits here Opa, here we go I like to cut them usually in half or two or three bits because they're a little bit too big so we'll cut them like this just to break them up so they fit nicely just like that all this beautiful seafood again was from our, our friends at Preston Market so that's our prawn so we'll put that into the mixture, like that. Just in there. Out of our seafood mix, we'll just pull out what we want. A few mussels. Not too many, just a few. There's some octopus in there as well. Little bits of calamari. We'll mix them up. We'll probably maybe sneak... We have some all our legs here from the calamari, so we might steal a couple just to put it in as well. So there we go. So we'll cut these up just like that. Mix it all in. And from the garden, we'll get some beautiful parmesan. Parsley, not parmesan. Bloody parsley. Then we'll put that in as well. We'll cut it very fine. Just like that. We'll put that in there. We'll put a bit of salt and pepper. There's the pepper. And a bit of salt. We want to make a nice stuffing. A bit of chili. Give it some taste and a bit of spice. And oh. We need to go get a lemon. So let's go, sweetheart. Opa, here we go. So we cut the lemon, leave the rest for later. A freshly squeeze of lemon in that. Let me give it a bit of a mix. Just like that. And that's our stuffing, it's ready to go. We'll grab our beautiful calamari. And Jack the Greek always likes using his fingers. So we'll grab a, a nice bit there, we'll push it in. Just like that. Just like that. Make sure we, make sure we get a good mix of the seafood. At the end, we'll grab a little stick, just like that, and we'll sew it up. Just like that. We'll put a bit of salt and pepper on top, just like that. Turn it over. A bit of pepper, a bit more salt, and that is one ready to go. The next one, we're going to make it a little bit different. We're going to add some garlic butter. So we'll put some garlic butter in there now because we want to try them a little bit different. 
mix it up. Just like that. And we'll do the same thing with another one. So now we've made two, one with garlic butter and one with just seafood and the chilies. Push it down, spread it out. I reckon we can feed a little bit more. And away we go. We grab another stick. We sew it up just like that. Only needs two or three times, because it won't escape. And away we go. And again, a little bit of salt on top. We'll turn it over, a bit more salt. Pepper. We'll clean up a little bit here on the side. Push that in. And what I'll do is, I'll quickly show you how I'm gonna pre prepare the crabs. They're even, even more simple. I'm gonna grab one or two crabs, put them here, just like that. And with the crabs, very simple. A touch of butter with garlic, just like that. A bit of pepper. And away we go. I'll finish off the rest and I'll be back to show you how we're going to cook it. We're back now. We've just finished uh, prepping all our food. We're about to put it onto the crossroad barbecue. But just finally, the last bit that's left, very simple with the legs, straight onto the tray like this. There's plenty of marinade underneath it from preparing all the, the stuffed calamari and the, uh, and the crabs. So very simple. Just put a bit of salt and pepper and a bit of bit of lemon. Mix them up on the same tray like this. And these will be a beautiful mezze while we're preparing and eating our beautiful Father's Day lunch today. So if you want to come in a little bit closer, I'll show you how I'm going to put everything in. So we have a beautiful selection here. Again, there's our stuffed calamari. Beautiful. So we'll grab it nice and gently. And over a moderate heat, as you can hear, and my hand can tolerate the heat, which means it's not very high. And you want to make sure that we cook these all the way through. Three. And the other two little ones we prepared behind the scenes will make it five in total. We will then have our legs. We'll just put here like this. Bit of the, bit of the, the butter is bringing up there. And with the crabs, we're going to put them up here. We're going to do something special because the Crossray Barbecue has this feature. We're going to like roast them in the heat. And then we're going to put them down for the last couple of seconds to brown them up a little bit. But for now, we're gonna sit up there while our calamari is on the bottom. We've got our calamari legs over here. And this will take around 15 minutes to cook. Five to seven minutes either side for the calamari. 10 minutes for the legs. And nice up there in the moderate heat, they'll be done at the same time. So from Jack the Greek, we'll see you in about 15 minutes. Plate up our beautiful seafood. Opa! We're about 10 minutes into our cooking. We need to turn over our calamari. We need to see how everything's going. So look at this. Ah, oh, beautiful smells. Beautiful smells. And you might notice in the little corner there, we have some corn because we're asked to put some on at the last minute. So I've turned these over before once, but I haven't turned over our stuffed octopus yet. But as you can see, all the tentacles 
are starting to cook through beautifully. And they're nearly ready now. Just a few more minutes. The crabs, as you can see, are cooking away. The butter is melting. It is fantastic. So let's turn over this calamari very gently. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Excellent, Opa. And then as you can see, they're all holding together very, very well. Beautiful. It's very important you cook these over a moderate heat, not too high, so you don't overcook the outside without cooking the inside. And there's a hint from Jack the Greek on Father's Day. So beautiful, five, 10 minutes to go, and we should be ready to serve our beautiful Father's Day seafood lunch. But I want you to come in closely to see how we're all going. Look at that, it's fantastic. So I'm going to get the plate now, I'm going to bring the plate close and just lift up our calamari and put it on the table, on the platter just here. Turn this around, just look at the juices, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, look at that, turn that one as well. And there we go. I'll also put the, uh, all the legs on the side there. Look at that, beautiful. Just like that. And there we go. Now what we're gonna do is, while we're preparing this, I'm gonna drop down the, the crabs, just to brown them up a little bit. And we'll move our corn here that our beautiful daughter Anastasia asked for, special request. So we'll drop these down and you can hear them already. They're starting to crackle. So we'll leave them there and we'll be back in a minute. So what we'll do now is quickly grab our olive oil, just spray it on top like that. Beautiful. We'll grab a bit of oregano. Ah, straight from my mum. Mum's homemade oregano. And again, the lemon you saw us pick up earlier from the back of the tree, we'll prepare that. We'll keep the rest of the lemon for the crabs. And while we're here, what I want to show you is actually what it looks like inside. So now that we've prepared it, that's our dish. And what I'll do is, is I'll cut one open just on an angle, but not, not the normal way that I would cut it, but just to show you the beautiful inside. Beautiful. Look at that. Fresh seafood with chili and garlic stuffed in calamari. Cut it up a bit more. Turn it a little bit on the side like that. And that's also another way that you could serve your beautiful stuffed calamari with seafood on Father's Day. Opa from Jack the Greek. Okay, so we've plated up our calamari. I've showed you how I've done that. Now very quickly, we're gonna grab our crabs. Beautiful. They're all done. Nice and crispy and toasted. We'll put them here, just quickly. And the corn can sit there on the side, but I'll show you what I'll do now. Very quickly. One, two. We do want everyone eating. This beautiful crab. Straight in the middle. One either side. There we go. Get that here as well. And as I said, a bit more lemony on top. A bit of oregano. That's a beautiful olive oil. There we go. The table's a little bit messy, but if we put this aside. 
give it a bit of a wipe. We have two beautiful seafood dishes from Jack the Greek on Father's Day. Opa, and see you next time.